Good morning, everyone. Um, so today we are going to be doing the BoxyCharm unboxing for August. And as well, we are going to go ahead and do slash get ready with me because I do have people to see today, and places to go today. Um, so yeah, it is Monday morning. It's 7. Woke up at 7, but it's like 7.20ish now. So I'm going to go ahead and get this started for you. Um, so with the first product that we got in our BoxyCharm, or actually, let me start with this. The first theme was totally boxy, so like totally boxy. Like I feel like every time I say totally, I sound like um, a valley girl, even though I am in the valley. Um, I'm like totally boxy, right? But anyways, <laughs> the theme is totally boxy. And the first product that I am going to go ahead and use is the Wonder Beauty Glowhead Illuminating Oil. And I'm going to use this as my primer before I go ahead and set like natural makeup makeup. Um, so it says glow, glow Ahead Illuminating Oil. It does retail for $42 and it is a full size product as you can see. Um, it's pink, I love this color just because it is a very pastel pink. I love my pastel colors more than like my bright colors. Um, so let me go ahead and open this up. <sighs> oh, and if you guys are wondering what this is, this is actually my husband's robe. Um, it's my favorite robe because it's my only robe and it's not even mine, it's his. Um, okay, so I went ahead and poured it and as you guys can see, it's this pink sparkly color and ooh, and it feels like you can feel the little grains in it, but it says oil and let's see, let's see what happens. I think I need more. So you can't really see, I'm looking at my mirror right here, um, you can't really see the sparklies in my face like once you put it on like the sparklies go away just because they are so tiny and so thin um as well i already did go ahead and wash my face and i did my hair already before i went ahead and started to film this as you can see i was inspired by Elle woods when she's taking her house sets and she has her two like chonguitos type of situation going on just because sometimes i feel like i need like that type of inspiration like yeah i'm Elle woods too I'm not. I wish I was, but I'm not. Okay, so now that I went ahead and put that on, I'm going to go ahead and just put my basic foundation on, my concealer, and then I'm going to go ahead and come back with the Becca Hydro Mist and Refresh Powder as my setting powder. So I'm going to go ahead and speed this up, and as you guys can see, my lighting just went ahead and fell because you always need good lighting. So I'm going to go ahead and speed this up for just my regular face makeup, and then I'm going to come back with this set. concealer corrector photo focus one and this is I don't know what shade this is actually I think I took the sticker off um oh actually it says light slash medium beige so I did go ahead and I kind of like this one I kind of don't I just I was testing it and then I just kind of kept it just because I didn't want to go to the store and get another one so I'm just kind of using it um till it gets to the last drop pretty much and let me see as you can see I like Okay, so I just hit my regular zones under my eyes, the tip of my nose, above my cupid's bow, and right here. To be honest with you guys, I just kind of go along with what I see. Because <laughs> sometimes I just look ridiculous, and sometimes it just comes out so great that I'm just like, wow, like, wow, like, you know what I mean? Um, okay, so now with the Becca Hydra Mist Refresh Powder, it retails for $39, and I don't know if it tells you the shade, I feel like it, since it's a setting powder, it just has like basic shades, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, it doesn't, does it have a shade? No, it doesn't, and I've actually never tried the setting powder, usually the one that I use is the Pretty Vulgar setting powder that I also got in BoxyCharm, but I got it as part of the BoxyLux. Um, so right here it says, keep me close to keep me cool. Ooh, so it comes like this. And then you open it like this and then it has the little foam. Well, I wouldn't really say it's a foam, but 
Ah, ah. Okay, so I barely took this out and it like kind of exploded on me, but it's okay. So I'm gonna go in with my little sponge here. Ooh, okay. Oh, wow. It feels wet. Like the powder itself as I'm applying it feels wet and it's not just because my beauty, my small beauty blender is wet. It's because it, it feels like it's just really wet. Ooh, I like how that feels. That feels really refreshing actually. Okay. And then for the actual product, it looks like it has a netting in here. Also, if I'm setting this incorrectly, sorry, not sorry. This is how I set my face. Um, but wow. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I really like how this feels. It feels wet. Like it still feels wet. It feels like it's like sliding down my face, even though I know it's not. Um, I really like that feel actually. Wow. That's great. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with my cover FX. I also got this in BoxyCharm. Do you guys sense the pattern here with my makeup? Um, so pretty much ever since I signed up, I don't have to buy makeup. Um, and I'm going in with the contour shade right here. And this has a mirror too, so it's great. And then i um, putting my contour right in between where I put the setting powder. Okay. Right in between. I don't know if you guys can see it. Okay. And I like to take this one when I go on vacation just because it is a good, it has everything like my highlight, my finishing powder, my blush. Um, so I really like this one whenever I'm just on the go. And as you guys know, I'm in the process of moving or I don't know if you guys know, but I'm in the process of moving right now. So this is just in my kit. And then next I'm going to go in with my blush. Wait, did we get a blush? No, no. No, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. Okay. So the blush, I'm using the one here. And this one is in the color Sublime. And then I'm putting it here a little bit. Okay. And I'm blending it into my contour. I actually learned that from one of my friends, um, Allie. She's a makeup artist. Um, she likes to blend her in, so I'm like, she knows what she's doing. I'll do the same thing. Um... And then for my highlight, I am actually going to go ahead and use the Ace Beauty Glimmer Shadow Duo. And these retail for $25. They're so pretty. This one's a little bit too bright um, for my skin tone, but I'm just going to go ahead and put a little bit on it. I actually should have just used this one as blush, but whatever. Um, I'm actually going to use the shade Iced Latte, which is making me crave a nice latte. So if you finish this, I might go get one. Um, I'm going to use this as my highlight. But first, I'm going to go ahead and wipe off this setting powder. And I'm using this brush that I got. Well, I didn't get it. My husband got it for me as a Christmas present from Target. The Sophia Kashuk. Last time on my channel, I said it really wrong. But Sophia Kashuk. Kashuk. I like that name. Like, imagine. They're like, oh, what's your name? I'm Miss Shook. Like, they'll just be like, damn. She's always shook. I don't know. I thought that it, it was funnier in my head. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with my other brush. And this is the brush I usually use for my highlight. Um, and I'm gonna go in with the Ice Latte. Again, this is a shadow. So let's see how this looks on my cheeks. Probably now I could look like a disaster today and I actually have somewhere important to be today. So we'll find out, we'll find out. Okay, so I am applying it right here i didn't get all the setting powder off <laughs> okay all right so so i think i'm just gonna make this a whole combo situation let's see how this looks Oh, okay, so it's looking actually pretty cute. It's not bad. It's not bad. Let me go ahead and zoom you guys in really quick so that you guys can see it. As I said, it's a shadow, so I don't really expect it to be like a like bright ass highlight, you know, like some of my other highlights that I have that are like in your face. So, 
Uh, maybe I'm going to add a little bit more. This might look a little crazy in the sun, but honestly, it's it's not as bad as I thought. I thought it was going to be a lot worse. So let me go ahead and zoom you guys in. Um, with this, and you guys can see that little, like, little hint of glitter, usually for my highlight. I don't like it to be so crazy if I'm, like, going to meet with people. If I'm going out, like, it's going to be crazy. It's going to be lit. Okay, so... And then for this one, I'm actually just going to take a fluffy brush for the pink one. And I'm going to just use this as a little, like a little pop on my, on my eyelid. And all my makeup is all over the place. So if you guys hear me swishing, swishing brushes around, it's because my makeup's all over the place. And my brushes are all over the place here in the bathroom. Okay, so not a little bit. Let's see how this looks oh that's cute okay so um i don't know if you guys saw earlier i didn't put any concealer or any setting base on my eye so i'm just going with the makeup and i guess whatever i had on my eyelid the illuminating oil and as well just so you guys know um that hydra mist setting powder like i can still feel it and it still feels a little wet on my face not like wet where it's like crazy wet, but just wet to where it's like it feels refreshed. Like my face feels refreshed. Okay, so it's giving me like a little little pop of pink. I'm not going to make it too extreme just because, um, like I said, I have some people to see today. I, and I don't want to go in looking crazy. Or, you know, like when you have really important days and you, you, you don't want to go like overboard and then somehow you end up going overboard with your makeup and then you're just like, crap, like this was way too extreme for the occasion. Just because you, you try to make it a, like give it a little like spunk and then like you put too much spunk in it and then you're just like, well, this is how I look today. And then you feel like a potato. That's how I feel. So I don't want to put that much on here but it's a really cute shade it does give you that like little pop that you want and let me go ahead and swatch this out for you guys that way you guys can actually see how it looks so you see it's very like pigmented and stuff and you guys can see my phone in here because it's just easier for me to put pause and go on my phone but okay and then okay so those were the eyeshadows. Next, I'm going to go in with the... Actually, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward because I'm going to do my eyebrows real quick. And I'm going to curl my lashes. And since we do have a mascara this month, it's called the Tarte Big Ego Mascara. And this one retails for $23. So I'm going to go in with that and then I'm going to finish up with the lip liner. Okay, guys? I don't know if you guys saw but I use a spoon so basically I stick this in between and I go like this basically I don't know I don't like using eyelash curlers just because I feel like it's gonna chop my whole eyelash off and I feel like with a spoon I just that's the way I learned that's the way my mom does it and like all my aunts do it so that's how I do it um but yeah so let's go ahead and move forward so the next thing on here is the Tarte Big Ego Mascara it retails for $23 and that's actually good because I just ran out of my mascara and I was close to buying one, but I'm just like, no. Nah. Ooh, and it's this hot pink color. And it is this hot pink color that you guys see. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and open it. And you're never supposed to like go like this to it because it pumps air into it. And I, I didn't know that before. Now I do. So now I don't do it. Um, but I am going ahead and applying it on my lashes. Okay. And the brush is very, um, it's very big, um, it's a big brush, if you guys can see this, and it has that little curve in the middle to it, so I'm going to go ahead and dip it back in here, and it is making my lashes touch the sky a little bit, ooh, I actually like, oh crap, I got them in my eye, oh well. Okay, 
well it doesn't burn if you get it in your eye because i just got it in my eye and it's not burning my eye off okay so if you guys can tell the difference between my non-mascara lash and this lash it looks pretty good looks pretty good okay so let's go in with this one So are you guys ready to go back to school? Um, because I am. I love school. Like, I love school ever since I was a little kid. I cried on a Sunday slash Saturday when there was no school. I know. Most of you guys are like, dude, what? Like, she's crazy. Just a little bit. But I love school. I still love school. I plan on continuing my schooling. Like, I'm almost done with my bachelor's. And then I'm going to go towards law school. So if you guys are out there, please pray for me. Hopefully I get in. Hopefully I get a good LSAT score. Um, because things are crazy competitive and I just messed up, but it's okay. So as you can see, my lighting has just gone from bad to worse. Um, okay, so I went ahead and did this. And I got a little smudge right there, but I'll clean that off after. So all in all, I really like this mascara. It made my lashes really thick and really big. And I missed like a tiny little spot here. Okay. And lastly, what I have on here is the um, Saint Laurent lip liner. And let's go ahead and see this color because if it's not this color, I'm not gonna use it. Sorry, you guys. Okay, so I'm trying to open it because the seal is still on here, which I'm glad. I'm glad the seal is on here. I'm glad I have to do the work and take the seal off because I don't want people trying these lip liners and then just leaving them there. Okay, so this specific color is... Is a color called Chic. So I'm going to go ahead and wipe just my babas that I have on here. And I'm going to line my lip. Okay, so um, as you guys can see, it's a very hard pencil. Yeah, so nothing's happening. Okay, I'm going to wet it. Give me a sec. Okay, so I wet it. And it still feels drier than my feet. Yeah, so this lip liner, not the business, not the business. It's taking it like a lot. Like I have to like scrape it kind of to get the color out. Okay, well, as good as it gets, right? And this one, I don't know if I said, it retails for 15 bucks. Um, so let me, I don't know how I feel about this. I actually like it. It just feels very dry and very patchy, but I like it. It's not a bad, not a bad thing. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the calculations real quick, and then this is my finished look for the day today. It actually came out really cute. I really love it. Mine is this little, this little crimp that you see right here, but whatever, whatever. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and do mental math. So 39 plus 42. Okay, so 39 plus 42. You're seeing, I'm like seeing numbers all over the place. Um, so that's round, that's one, that's one, four, seven, eight. So that's 81 plus 23. So 20, that's 100. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to use a calculator. I'll be right back. Okay, so I did the, I used my calculator on my phone. Um, so the total price for this um, month's BoxyCharm was 115 bucks, and you got all those five slash six products. And I did go ahead and get version two, but yeah, if you guys went ahead and liked this video, um, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Um, if you want to go ahead and share it with your friends, feel free to. Um, but yeah. Oh, also follow me on my show socials. I only have Instagram right now because I'm not really big on Facebook, so yeah, sorry. Um, but my Instagram is at do it with Diana as well. I'm going to be uploading, um, like three videos this month. Hopefully, 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 hopefully if the whole moving thing and everything goes straight and goes like whew, smoothly. Um, okay. 
<laughs> somehow I have to go ahead and actually get dressed and then once I get dressed I'm gonna get ready to go okay thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week and a wonderful back to school um in case I don't see you guys before then or I forget to post or whatever whatever the reason may be I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your month slash week slash day um thank you guys so much bye